Well, Texas Governor Greg Abbott said yesterday there will no longer be a mask mandate as of next Wednesday, and that's left county leaders feeling a lot of questions today on what the new rules exactly are. Six News reporter Andrew Moore spoke to those leaders today to help sort that out. Andrew? Bell County Judge David Blackburn says he's received constant phone calls from Bell County offices and local businesses asking, what are we supposed to do now? So here are the new rules under this new executive order. Blackburn said with his understanding, county offices can no longer require masking. Businesses, on the other hand, can require masks in the same way they would require customers to wear shoes or a shirt. Some local businesses may still be weighing that decision. Baylor, Scott and White hospitals and clinics will continue to require masks, and it's a good bet other medical facilities will as well. It's also important to mention, while masks are not required, the governor says they are still encouraged. Blackburn says he believes the decision was made due to the much lower number of COVID hospitalizations we are seeing. Local doctors say, please keep masking at this time because we are not out yet. And if you look at the hospitalization rate across the state, if you look at the hospitalization rate for, for Bell County, uh, we're in the single digits now. Um, when not too long ago, we were double digits and above that 15% threshold. COVID-19 puts a significant strain on the healthcare system, and we want to be able to serve people who have normal, un-COVID related needs as well. The new executive order also gives counties a small amount of local control if hospitalizations were to rise again. We'll talk more about that coming up at 6. Andrew Moore, 6 News.